Oh, yeah, baby. Look at that. <laughs> Woo! That's the pool winner right here. Look at these. Nice. Oh, yes. I like that. The big head bob. Like Good. something nasty down there. Let's talk a little bit about where to find these black belly rose fish. It's a structure oriented species. You need some kind of bottom. You can pick a couple on the open kind of mud flats, but you really want some rocks, some outcroppings, depressions, hills, anything that separates that bottom is gonna hold these rosies, okay? Depth, 600 to 2,000 feet. Of course, on the high end, nobody's deep dropping in 2,000 feet. We're in 775, 800 foot, somewhere in that ballpark. And I'll tell you, they're all up and down the coast here, all up and down the southeast coast. They're almost impossible not to find. They really are. But do a little bit of homework, you know, study some charts, look at your machine, you know, know the bottom, and focus those efforts on area that have, you know, areas that have structure. And once you're there, I mean, look at that rod tip. There's one eating it right now. Look, look, look yep, yep just got to the bottom and if you're on top of them you're going to get bites in literally minutes if you don't get a bite in five minutes move on you're not on top of them so it's all about the structure and i'll tell you though like every other fishery it's very detail oriented it's not as simple as just coming out dropping a rig down and loading up you know you do have to do your homework and we're going to talk a lot more about the tackle as the morning progresses but everything's got to be right in order to maximize on this fishery. But if you do it right, you certainly can come out here and have a great time, load up, and put some great tasting fish in the box. Oh yeah, there's a couple on there. I'm gonna get a little greedy, see if I can get a couple more. It's a long way up for just one.